excuse me, whatever, but I'm just going to be leaving it uncovered a little bit today. Hmm? It's a turn, my head. Yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised you're more pain, honestly. I am, I'm in a lot. I just wish I could take the fucking tram doll. Nope. Stuff is poison. I feel like I need a heating pad on my entire body. guys you probably are a little um confused as to what just happened um so basically long story short me and adrian were sitting and figuring out details about a vacation that we're going on that we bought tickets for today and um yeah we were just talking and then I feel him shaking me and saying, um, like, come on, we have to go to the hospital, we have to go to the hospital, and I was just like, I was mad at him, and I was like, no, we don't, we don't have to go to the hospital, stop. And he was like, you had a seizure, you need to, I just talked to your mom, you need to go to the hospital. And, um, and so, obviously, we ended up, uh, we ended up going, um, he drove us. And he, um, yeah, he basically said that we were just sitting, everything was cool, and then he said that I, like, leaned my head back and, um, put my arms up and then, you know, did the, the, you know, like, the normal seizure thing that people do. And then he said that I just kind of, like, turned over my side and he said I just smacked down on the floor. My glasses are completely broken in, like, six places. And, um, and yeah, so basically, so basically we went to the hospital and I had a grandma seizure again, um, and they, um, yeah, basically I had to have stitches placed on because I had a really bad, las bad laceration to, um, to, uh, my head here if you can see it um but the doctor the doctor did a really good job stitching it thank god and then i have like bruises around my eyes and on my nose um so um it's good though that this happened because i do have the eeg on and they can see you know around the time that it happened they can see exactly um what my brain was doing, which is a ma major plus. Um, so yeah, I basically just got the, um, I got the, uh, stitches and, um, we were, we were sent home, which is totally fine. So, um, so that's, that is what's up. That's what happened. Um, I'm, like, now I'm not able to take my pain medication, and, um, I'm in so much pain from everything, so it really sucks that I, I really, I can't do anything about it, and, um, just everything is so, like, tense and sore, and I'm bringing my heating pad up, my TENS unit, I'm just gonna try to do a whole bunch of things to help me feel a bit better but I need to give you guys like a proper update on what happened so right now I'm trying to eat some yogurt and like relax um because everything is just hurting so much so I will see you guys a little bit later I think it's about 10, 10 p.m. right now these things look at them I can't wait to rip these out. Okay, I am 
um, done. We pulled the leads off. I'm gonna show you guys. Can't even see that I had anything on there. My hair is just so wet, so it looks a little bit messy. Um, so, yeah, um, it's been a really strange, um, it's been a really strange, um, like, 24 hours, um, I thought that the seizure was just medication related and that it wasn't, you know, like it wouldn't happen, happen again, but it did. Um, Adrian said I just kind of like leaned back, started se seizing, le leaning back, and then he said I just went like over and like he said that I basically like threw, you know, unconsciously obviously, but I threw myself like on the ground and um, the way I landed, I hit my glasses. Um, I don't think I've shown you what my glasses look like, but I shattered my glasses and um, so I'm wearing contacts now and um, I just, I woke up and Adrian was like, saying he was going to clean my face. He's like, come on, we have to go to the hospital. We have to go to the hospital. And I was like, no, we don't. We're not going to the hospital. Why are you freaking out? I didn't realize that something had happened. Um, so he's like, you had another seizure. We need to go to the hospital. I just talked to your mom. So then we went to the hospital and um, they, they did some, ouch, ow. They did some, um, gave me Ativan just to like, because I wasn't feeling well and I was in a lot of pain and I shake a lot of times when I'm in pain. Um, so I was shaking, but... Yeah. But obviously I'm a little bit better today. I kind of shake normally, but I'm better. My biggest thing right now... Oh, and let me show you guys the... I think you probably can see the stitches. I got four stitches or five stitches. Oh, I'll insert the picture of what it looked like when I went first went to the emergency room now. Why is it snowing? I forgot to finish the video that I was doing earlier, um, but basically, hopefully you guys can see, I just have a lot of um, bruises and little spots of irritation and stuff around my eyes. Um, I'm not buying glasses for a little while, I'm just doing contacts just because we don't want to buy sungla or glasses and then have me have a seizure and break them. Um, yeah, I'm just, it's, it's rough because I'm in pain with my, like, neck and, like, my body hurts, but I can't take anything because we don't know what's going to be safe for me to take, so I literally can't take anything at all. Um, so everybody's out. I was able to stay back, um, come here, Max, to watch a show. It's one o'clock in the morning, actually. Um, I'm watching the show that I've been watching for the past, like, week. It's really called, good. It's called Seven Seconds. Um, so me and Max are just chilling out. And um, I'm sorry my vlogging has been kind of like weird the past two days, but for uh, for obvious reasons, it's been a little bit messed up. Um, so yeah, I'm just watching the show and hanging out with Max who can't stop crying. Yeah, and that's pretty much about it. Hopefully everybody comes home soon. Okay, so I have two episodes left, and, like, the beginning half of the last episode and then the episode beforehand were a little, like, um, like, just not as good because they were, like, working on, like, picking stuff, um, uh, getting, like, the story set up, but the last, like, 15 minutes have been just, like, crazy. And I'm really liking the show. Um, if anybody's bored and wants to watch it, it's on Netflix. Um, it's called Seven Seconds. It's really, really, really good. 
um, so I'll probably end up potentially finishing this show tonight. Definitely worth worth binge watching. It was really, really, really good. I'm excited to see like how the show ends and stuff. So this one won't stop talking or stop crying. Anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna finish watching this episode. Hey guys, so it's just about 7:20 at night. Um, I've slept a lot of today because I wasn't feeling well, but then, um, I don't even know what I'm saying. Oh yeah, no, I've just been, I've been in bed and just not doing well. You can see that the bruise on my eye is getting like, it's really, really bad. I have a few other bruises on like my legs, I have the stitches here. But, um, we had originally made plans to go to France, so that was the exciting thing I was talking about. And after the other day, um, we're not going to go, but we didn't buy travel insurance, so we are able to, like, um, cancel my, like, our Airbnbs, but we don't think that we can cancel the flights, so just really, really upset with everything that's been going on. It's terrible to feel like I don't have control at all. Um, it's just frustrating because like I, I want to go on vacation really bad, like so bad, but we're watching diners, drive-ins, and dives, and Andrew went to go get food. I'm just kind of hanging out tonight, kind of counting down the hours until I can go to sleep again. See